Greetings everybody, Pavlos Lagoret is here for Wager Talk TV with another free play in the Copa America. This match goes live on Monday, 9pm Eastern. It's a match between Brazil and Costa Rica as Brazil are kicking off their Copa America uh, in a tricky match. Uh, now we've been doing a really good job in, the, uh, in soccer the last couple of days, plus 12.5 units in the last three days alone. Number one in soccer at Wager Talk during that time. And uh, before our free play, I wanted to invite you guys to like and subscribe to our channel. Drop a comment below with your plays or if you have something to say. I'm always glad to, to read and respond to all the comments. Uh, before a free play, I wanted to remind you guys uh, of our new soccer promo. Uh, now, you can get 90 days of soccer for only $2.99. Regular price is $5.99. And you'll get all soccer plays, all 5% releases, all the futures and all the props for three months. And that includes all the rest of the Euros, the Copa America, the Leagues Cup uh, that comes in um, you know, late July. Uh, the MLS, Copa Libertadores, the start of the European club uh, soccer, uh, you know, EPL, Bundesliga and all that stuff, and uh, even the start of the Champions League. So uh, use code SOC90, SOC90, to get 90 days of soccer for only 2 99 Now, uh, onwards to our free play. Uh, this match is between Brazil and Costa Rica on Monday, June the 24th, uh, 9 p.m. Eastern. Right off the bat, this Brazil side looks like the weakest Brazil we've seen in quite a while. Uh, they're coming here with a new coach as Dorival Jr. took, um, uh, took charge uh, four matches ago. He only had the chance to play four friendlies for Brazil. Um, they didn't lose any, any you know, of the four. They beat England by, by 1-0. Uh, they had a 3-3 draw against Spain, a 3-2 win against Mexico, and a 1-1 draw against USA. Now, Neymar is going to miss this match, uh, this uh, tournament all over altogether because he is injured. So... Uh, this Brazil side doesn't really have a bona fide, you know, striker, a pure number nine. They're going to use probably Rafinha on the right wing, uh, Vinicius on the left wing, and Rodrigo up front, who is not a striker, and he might encounter some problems against the defenses. Now, um, again, this is a team that Brazil, even uh, Ronaldinho himself said that this is a, you know, a, a, a bad Brazil side. I mean, if you looked at Brazil... A couple of decades ago, you would see some mind-boggling players there, some, uh, you know, Adriano, Ronaldo, some really impressive players. And now their midfield is uh, kind of meh, if you ask me. I don't know why Paqueta is there. Paqueta, if you remember, he was caught uh, essentially rigging matches, getting yellow cards. He should be suspended, in my opinion, but for whatever reason, he's in there, he's going to start. Uh, in the defense, uh, they still haven't decided which two are going to be their centre-backs. Uh, it's going to be Marquinhos from PSG and either Militao from Real Madrid or Beraldo, who also plays for PSG. Uh, there's still a couple of moving pieces there, but uh, again, I think this is um, it's not going to be as easy uh, as the odds suggest. Because right now, uh, Brazil are minus, let's see here, minus 650 favourites against Costa Rica. The draw is at plus 715, and Costa Rica money line is at plus 1600. Uh, with uh, the, the Asian spread set at 2.25, Brazil minus 2.25 is even money, and uh, Costa Rica plus 2.25 is minus 120. And I'm going to go with Costa Rica plus 2.25 goals here, which is a split line between Costa Rica plus 2 and Costa Rica plus 2.5. And, and uh, you know... I know this might be an unpopular opinion, but I know everybody's going to bet on Brazil, but uh, I'm not really sure if Brazil is going to have such an easy job here because Costa Rica, uh, they have a new generation of players, a lot of players coming in from their under-22s. Um, they have a, a really talented uh, young generation. Not really sure how that is going to translate to this competition, but uh, for whatever reason, Costa Rica have not lost by a lot against Brazil in the recent matches. The only match that they lost by three goals or more uh, was back in 2004 where Brazil had Adriano up front who scored the hat trick, and then prior to that he had they had Ronaldo and Rivaldo up front. So in recent years uh, and in, in some friendlies, Costa Rica they actually stood their ground. And Costa Rica they actually, you know, they have a, a coach that was coaching Ecuador up until recently, and uh, of course Ecuador have a much better roster overall, but they did. Um, hold Argentina to a draw, Brazil to a draw. They, they even lost to both Argentina and Brazil by a single goal. So this is match day one of this uh, Copa America. I think Costa Rica will try to upset Brazil. Not really sure if they can even get out of this group with Colombia and Paraguay in there. I think Brazil and, and, and uh, Colombia 
are probably going to be the two logical um, you know, uh, options for this, uh, you know, to qualify from this group. But, you know, if you pick Brazil minus 2.25, you essentially need them to win by three goals to get a full payout. What happens if Costa Rica score once? You're going to need Brazil to win by four. And Brazil haven't won by four goals in quite a while. I think they only beat uh, Bolivia. And that match was uh, at home. Uh, this match, you know, all this match, this competition is played in the USA. So uh, it's not exactly a home advantage for Brazil. Now, again, Brazil, they have a, not a strong team. It's not a weak team either, but it's not a strong team. And uh, I think Costa Rica can upset, him, uh, upset them here. Uh, again, if they score a goal, Brazil would require four uh, for you to get paid a full payout if you pick Brazil minus 2.25. I, you know, I'm just taking one unit, a small, we're using a one to five uh, units on our bets. This is the smallest I could, uh, I could go. One unit on Costa Rica plus 2.25. Uh, just to see if they can upset the Brazilians who, you know, the more uh, blitz blonde Brazilians you see in a lineup, the less, uh, you know, serious they are. And uh, I know this might seem superficial, but it's not. Uh, if you remember the good old days of Brazil, there was no guy with the blonde hair. They were all super focused. They didn't have like a number of uh, tattoos or whatever, 15 supercars. They were really focused on playing soccer. So, um, yeah, I think this generation of Brazilian players, uh, they're cruising for a bruising. I'm not really sure if Costa Rica are going to give it to them, but maybe Colombia or Uruguay, or Uruguay does. Now, as far as this match goes, again, Costa Rica, they can upset here. Uh, if they score a goal, it's going to be really hard for Brazil to cover. Um, so give me Costa Rica plus 2.25 goals at minus 120, and let's see how this goes. So again, like and subscribe to our channel, uh, drop a comment below if you, if you think I'm crazy for picking Costa Rica here, or if you agree that they might be able to upset Brazil maybe with a goal. Um, I'm going to have one more free play video in the uh, Italy versus Croatia match, so stay tuned because we give these uh, free plays every single day. Cheers and God bless.